love gold. All right, let's go ahead and put you on here. These things are always so wonky, so weird. Like, I get the the. It's like, hey, how many times, how far away do I have to be to place this? Ah, oh, so nice. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back in Hydranir. Begin this work. Getting after this work, kid. I have no idea if this will work. <laughs> but I'm trying. So, off camera, grinding, bro. Just shoveling as deep as I can go. The plan is to have this go down to here. This is the... the the bottom actually I think it goes down just like another maybe a half step or a half block it's nice that we have the grid blocks now so that when we decide we want to build something we have a nice little grid so that's one block down two block down three block down and so on and so forth and then the more blocks that you go down the better the gold and the, the, the jewels and the treasure that you're gonna find but just getting to here is ridiculous so these conveyor belts right here they cost like 330 hydro this conveyor belt costs 100 hydro and you only get one of these what yeah you only get one of these guys it's ridiculous so also because of a wonderful video by our friend hybrid steel he teaches you all about what these pipes do and what you can do to do uh to you know power them up Make them faster, better, stronger. There are boosters that you can get inside that anvil joint, the iron forge, what I'm going to call it. And uh, you have to actually craft them. It costs like 300 some odd iron along with the uh, the continuum. What is this called? What is this called? Cloudium. I'll call it whatever I want. <laughs> Gets confusing from time to time. So, we got to work our way there. we got to crawl before we walk. Baby steps. Baby steps, bud. Baby steps. Listen to me. All right, so if I were to turn you on, turn you off, wonderful. So we have this. Now, when it comes to the conveyor belts and the pipe system, it used to be a thing where the conveyor belts would go a certain direction and you can only put pipes in a certain way. And then you had all sorts of stupid things that you had to try and figure out to get like the pipes to just go down in, in one certain way. But now you can't place a conveyor belt without there being a pipe. And then you can place pipes, you know, uh, sideways through these things if you want to it just it has to have a pipe underneath the conveyor belt it has to otherwise it does not work it does not operate so these guys over here these pumps pump so I take this pumps water into a pipe system at a 100 pressure and you're like oh that's you know that's good but these pipes lose pressure every three percent one so three six nine twelve so on and so forth until you get to one of these guys are friends. Oh, hold on. This thing is not working properly. Beautiful. And you. Yes, you. Stop. Stop. Ow, quit it. And we turn that off. We're turning that off. Stop. Stop it. So these conveyor belts will then. Uh, work off of this with the power though with the whoa 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 thank you for saving appreciate the save out of nowhere I'm, I'm terrified let's grab this bat and we'll drop it like it's hot in there now this will now give you a hundred percent pressure back into the pipes and then of course so on and so forth it loses pressure every three and at the very end of the wraparound I got another jam right here hold on hold on hold on Got to clean things up here. And you know what? Let's go ahead and we'll smelt this down right here. We'll drop that like it is super duper hot because it is hot. It's, it is hot. Very, very hot. Still picking it up with my bare hands though. Don't tell anybody. Shh. It's our little secret. All right. We'll drop you in here so that all the pressure. Oh my God. I do have a hammer. I do have a hammer to lock this in place, but we have to make sure that it is all good to go drop that there so now after the conveyor belts goes in we only have we don't have a hundred percent but we have hundred minus three and six that's a ninety four percent pressure you don't know what it's like to feel the pressure so with the harvester then nifty it'll pump out drill out 
all the stuff go up the conveyor belt into the harvester into the sorter which I have I should probably get an iron piece otherwise it's gonna get real messy you have to put every single piece if you put every one of these pieces up here so I got iron I have a red gem stone I have a blue gemstone and a green gemstone as well as a power shard so that way that all gets separated into here you do have to line this up a little bit further back because it likes to fire it at will and also I have a block placed over here with a bunch of dirt hopefully it will work and we'll start getting those nougats the crumbs without having to use the shovel as much all right pray for me oh it's working yes 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 smelt up the gold it works <laughs> apparently that was garbage oh there we go awesome so we are working at not 100 percent capacity but enough that we're you know pumping out the volume pump up the volume pump up the volume dance dance doom 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 and also we have this splitting off over here so that we can actually do our other things Move this over here. I don't have a whole lot of space over here. Of course, we are just starting. We're starting back up. The trials, tribulations. But this whole setup is really gonna cost you, man, at least two to 2,500 hydro. You know what I'm saying? What's hydro? That's the coins. You can call it gold, you can call it iron, but when you pick it up, it's called hydro coins. So I'm gonna call it that hydro kid. <laughs> don't worry, our channel's used to calling things hydro. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Do you feel me? I know you feel me. I know you feel me. All right, so let's drop this down on the platform that I've made. Water goes in, and then that way you can just dump this in. Ready, set, whoo. Dump this in. Ooh, we got consortium as well. I always call it consortium. Is it consortium or continuum? Whatever. It's a stupid name is what it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that consortium. Cloudium. Ha. <laughs> Whatever's. You know what I'm talking about. We are going to dump that on here as well. So that way, just in case things get in there, it doesn't go into the mix, like literally. So the plan here is to try and get this conveyor belt to go further down until this drill gets to the very, very bottom where we can get the most, uh, the biggest gold, the, be the biggest of the bucks, the best of the best, the best around. And then hopefully we'll be able to get enough iron and cloutium in order for us to get a booster. And if we get a booster, then we're going to be boosting it up and it's going to boost the productivity of our drills super, super duper fast. But it's just going to take a bunch of time, which is what we have. Don't worry. We're, we've only been digging for a couple hours for a couple hours. This is all been this is all here for show. But I'm very happy that this is working somewhat, in some capacity. Yes, yes, yes. So the plan also, on top of that, is to build a stairwell that goes down. So I'm not constantly, like, hopping. Now, I also do have to buy the pumps, like the, the air, the filters, so that our machines don't constantly break down. That is also on my list of things to do. Things that I need to succeed or at least to stay viable at least because those things it gets super duper dirty super duper all the time that's a bummer it's only a matter of time before we start getting spanners toolboxes hopefully that that's been a little a little bit alleviated where it doesn't break down as much because that's super duper annoying it was it was terrible it was terrible it tells you we get some stairs over here quickly how much gold do we have or how much hydro we have 45 hydro we got that dro kid all right so we're gonna have to get some uh, some some pipes filters on them everything here we got the basics i mean as far as like a small furnace and just making things look you know proper might as well just throw another one in there we're gonna need it come on you can do it i need to be able to build a space for a workshop just some just some area some room to roam so that that way we can get rocking and rolling because this is just uh you know off the cuff kind of stuff okay let's see what we get out of this mix we've been letting it run for about five ten minutes ish esque roundabouts give or take let's drop it like it's hot in here oh yeah oh, ha, 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 ha. 
Spiffy. I got I got more of these things than I know what to do with most part. Let me see if I can get ourselves another uh, maybe two more stones. Little stone platforms here. Boop. One and two. Awesome sauce. Cracking. There we go. Much nicer. Much nicer. Hold on. We gotta get these little pieces out of here. These little dirt mounds. These no good. These good for nothing dirt mounds. All right. It's looking all right so far. There we go. Might as well just fill it up the tippy top. Get ourselves another little nougat or something. <laughs> awesome. Okay. What kind of prize do we have awaiting for us? Oh, that's a big one. Not the first time I've ever heard of that. Oh, God. Yeah, that should work. So how I have that, I have actually a smelter built in to the uh, concrete there. Because you can actually... you can you know, uh, clip into the stone. And that's what I got going on there. So let's see if I can just put, you know what? Uh, I'm going to take you. We're going to take you. I'm going to grab a, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. I made a mistake. <laughs> many a gems, many a gems have been poured out. My bad. Now, I will say this, if you need to start, like, smelting down whatever you want to smelt down, you may want to hold off, or you may just want to turn the machine off, because it's going to keep on going, and those, those clumps are not going nowhere. So, give it a rest, turn it off, and then get your sorting on. I may think about having, a, like, a hinge there, so I can just turn, uh, see, then we got, because this would have to be on. In order for that to roll like that, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We got problems. I got problems, man. I got problems. But it looks like you just have to turn it off and smelt it up, or just do it pretty quickly. Yeah, that's the ticket. It's not. It's not perfect yet, and nor will it be. And plus, we got ourselves a lot of gems, a lot of gems, a lot of cloudium. Now I know we can. You know what? We should turn it into a necklace. That's what we should do. We should turn it into a knight. We have enough gems. I just need to heat this up quick. And you know what? I'm going to turn this off because otherwise I'm just going to get pelted with all sorts of stupid stuff. Let's turn that off. All right. Now I'm also going to turn, I'm moving the valve from here to over here so it turns everything off. Plus, if you think if you have water going to this, it automatically just starts deteriorating this. But if you turn it off, it won't deteriorate such as fast. That's my theory, and I'm sticking to it. I have no knowledge of whether or not I am being truthful. But you know what? Gotta test it. You, you won't know until you know. Yes. Oh, my skillet. My flat iron skillet. It's a gold skillet. One. Two. Whoops. Two. Three. Oh, it's huge. It's the hugest thing I've ever seen. Huge. Yo, these ladies are gonna love it. Oh! <laughs> what if I put it over here? What does this do? Anything? Garbage. Right. Right. Now I forget at the top of my head which area I have to go to try and get this rock and rolling, but. Thousand coin, a thousand hydro. We got that hydro player. Well, nice. So we have a thousand twenty-one because I bought a fishing cage. I just need to be able to catch some fish on the fly. While I'm just, you know, spend some time. Let's go shopping. Oh, hold on a second. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go to sleep. Go to sleep. And if you take this way to try and go over to the town, you might get there a little quicker. It seems like it, though, is, it could be a little treacherous, a little more treacherous. But the town's right over here. And this water's not that deep. Yet. So far. Watch out, watch out, watch out. We're all good. We're all good. Everyone, calm down. Alright. What to buy, what to buy. We need cloudium hydro pipes. It's a like cloudium intake water pipe. 250% pressure. Really? What about these guys? Water filter hooks. Yeah. 
Yeah, we need these. On. Increases water quality by two, max 10. So you can get five, and that's math. Four, five. Uh, that's eight. <laughs> that's 870 bucks. Oh, good thing I came over here. Good thing I traveled all this way. All right, let's see how stupid this is to work. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, settle down, settle down, settle down. All right, how does this stupid stuff work? Just like that. Awesome, okay. We got one, three, looking real nice, four, and this is gonna fit perfectly right on the top there. Right on the top. And you know what, let's crank this up, baby. I got things to do, places to be. Get a cracking, get a crack a lacking. Now the pressure, this is actually pretty nifty. This you can see whether or not you're getting, oh, so we're getting 97% pressure because it's coming right after this. So totally right. So we'll, we can have this, it's nifty. I'm just happy that the conveyor belts, like we had better pressure going up to here. Like these conveyor belts could actually do pretty nice things. Now, when it comes to, can I put this on a bendy part? I cannot. It's a bummer. It's a real bummer, man. It's a real bummer. So we'll just put this over here. It's a nice little thing to have so we can test out where things are going wrong. <laughs> where, 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 where the problems lie. Drop it down there. You, you'll go into here. Burn. All right, continue. Continue to burn. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to grab all these gems. And we're going to cut them up. Nice. Just keep on, keep on giving me more, baby. Give me more. Like a Britney Spears song. Give me more. Give me, give me more. Give me, give me more. Give me more. Give me, give me more. Now, I'm also thinking that you could have some sort of weird conveyor belt system that hooks up to this. So say you pump out, like the conveyor belt will come out on this side. So this shoots and on the uh, shoots, whatever gets flushed out of here onto a conveyor belt. And then that'll go to another splitter, hand splitter. And then you can wrap it around and then uh, there's another splitter, you know, further down the line This shoots out stuff. So then you have different stations, but I don't know if you want to do that in the first area, especially since you get really, uh, you know, it really gets honed down, refined later on. So I don't know if you want to spend that kind of cash, that kind of clout to be able to get that stuff wrong, but you can do it. It's going to be kind of weird to try and time it. It'll be kind of spiffy. I think I might dig that. Look at all those pretty gems. Look at all of them. Uh, this is this is running. This is actually running pretty well. I'm, I'm actually impressed with myself. I'm actually happy with myself and how this turned out. This turned out just wonderful. Just wonderful. Hut. And we got some stuff over here. We can continue to, to dig if we feel the need to, or if you say, uh, you know what. I'm just going to watch things go by, I'm going to drink some tea and sit back and let it all unfold. Dump you in. Nice. Yes, burn, burn. That's what I want you to do, burn. And we'll take this, grab you, grab you. And final finale, the only thing I'm not going to hammer down and we're gonna hammer these down. The only thing I'm not gonna hammer down is these conveyor belts, just in case things get a little wonky. But as far as all these are concerned, these are good to go. Let's just make them solid. Solid as a rock, hard as a rock. Because all it's gonna take is one time of me going and doing something a little too fast, a little too quick, and then we're going to have an issue. And then all the things pop on down. Don't forget yourself a little rack here. So you got to be able to organize a little bit. Everything else is just all over the place. I always have a problem. An hydroneer. 
Always have, always will. I'm keeping my tools in check. I always have a problem keeping my tool in check. <laughs> and we also need some decorations. I need some light over here, bud. It's necessary. See, I care more about the aesthetic purposes of it than I really do about the functionality of it. Does it look nice? You know what I'm saying? Because if you look good, you feel good. All right, let's grab a you, pop you, get you, and I dropped it. I just wish there was a better way that this would like stick on there. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Get that ring. Bling, bling, pinky ring. No, I'm saying, baby. It's good. See how much this joint is. I like taking individual things. Yeah, so as far as the Iron Forge, I really gotta look further into it. Because as far as trying to get different blueprints and the basics to get you rock and rolling, to really get you started in this starting area. Nice. It's gonna take a bit. It's gonna take just a bit of time. I would say like an hour ish esque roundabouts, give or take. And then you can start getting into the Cloudium and the Iron and then maybe into the Blueprints. So that will be in another episode. Because me just trying to get this rolling <laughs> has become a task. I'm going to grab one of you. This is just for our bars. Because we have bars. Uh, you know what? I'm going to saw too. That's why we have all the tools. Other than this guy right here. That's right. I'm pointing. I'm pointing myself. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, so you can only get one of these over in the starting area. One per purchase. One per stock. That's a wrap. It's like, really? Really? Ah, the manual grind. You kids don't know anything about the manual grind. Yeah, this is what we had to do back in the days before there were automatic smelters. You wanted to get some cash? You wanted to make some money? All right, well, this is what you had to do. Magnets? You think magnets are buggy now? You should imagine what they were looking like back in the day. That's not what I wanted. That's, 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 keep that in the bucket. Bank that one in there. It's still moving around. Let it settle. There we go. We'll drop that in there. Oh, everything's looking good. Everything's looking real good, bud. That there. Do you have the wing? Mowage. Mowage is what brings us together today. And wove. Woo, wove. So we got the wing. And we're going to get ourselves an axe here in a second. But it seems like everything's kind of going the way that we were planning on it. We got our water system all hooked up. We got a pump that goes all the way down to here. We have an area that fills up automatically. So in case we wanted to keep on digging. The valve that turns everything on is over there. We have a tank that gives us 100% going into the harvester. And then that is a T point going into here, a T point going down and continuing to this drill, which also has a bar in it to give it 100% efficiency. We can do better though. I feel like we can do better. I believe in us. Boom. Now that, that is some treasure right there, bruh. Doesn't even fit, it's so so huge. Again, not the first time I've ever heard, heard that, said that, tried to get away with that. Uh, let's put this here. You know what? I'm just gonna bring this alone. Let's see what our axe will get us. Let me ask this thing a question. <laughs> 451 dollars. Hydro, that 451 hydro. Feeling good, power packing, rock and rolling. We, we, we've been everywhere. We've done everything. Except the one thing that I kind of want to check out, which I have not checked out yet. Fireflies in the sky. Come on, shake it up. Now stay lit. Place is gonna look like a freaking alien campground. So yeah, this is the starter spot. This is all you need to succeed and get ready to rock and roll and you know build your wealth. Build, build your wealth, your wealth, build your wealth. And start you off on the right track, the right step. How can I get on the right track? 
We live in a mine down by the river. And the wing, 406. Two items, over 800 hydro. Don't you know? Now we can start focusing a little bit, just a little bit, on getting deeper down in the mine, for one. Getting these coins, how much coins do we have here? 133, 539. Getting our uh, conveyor belt system going down to the ground. Oh, we also have our 70, 77th piece, our 77th spot, 616 coins. And know me better, man. Yes. And it looks like we're pretty efficient when it comes to the not needing spanners or wrenches. I'm just going to call it a wrench because I don't trust the spanner. Never. Until Hydraneer, I've never heard a wrench be called a spanner before. Never. Of course, I'm, I am a dumb American. Or a very intelligent one that just hasn't heard of new things. Wouldn't be the first time, not going to be the last. But folks, that is going to be your episode for today. The starting unit has been set up, and now we just got to we got to build on top of this, gain some cash, and then buy some new stuff. Build some new stuff. Can't wait. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. Helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos come out every single day, live streams every week. Make sure you hit the bell notification be aware of all the new content, everyone. Peace out, like shout y'all. I will check you out right here again. That's a lot of stuff that's in this bucket right here, bud. <laughs> a lot. I'm almost going to have to get another one of these just to sort out the iron. And hook it up another way. Yeah, I'll figure it out. Everyone, peace out like shout y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Hydraneer 2.0 next time.